Okay, Grim's Creed, we're back. And we've got a broken flashlight, and we've been told to dig around, see if we can find any clues. And uh, let's talk to Clementine. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. <sighs> What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Uh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> Talk to you later, Clem. Okay. <laughs> did you do it? Yeah. <laughs> That's funny shit. All right. So why can I? Uh, 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 uh. Oh, well, I successfully looked at the gates. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Okay. Oh, what's this? There's some broken glass on the ground there. Oh, pick it up. <laughs> oh, it matches. What was that? There's something drawn there. No shit. Hmm. Chalk. Pink. Hmm. Duck. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Right. Uh, I gather then by looking at Clementine, I gotta go talk to Clementine. Presuming to ask if she's got any pink chalk. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. <laughs> I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was coming to see him for clues Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. <sighs> Give my high five. Cool. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. <laughs> so, hang on, how can he go by the gate and find the chalk, but I have a look and I can't? Yeah. That's a bit stupid. Uh. Have you seen any chalk around? Ah, uh, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, she says she's missing a piece of it. Well, I don't know anything about that. Sorry, Lee. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Uh. You guys, uh, trust everyone here? 
more or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys <sighs> gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what, then? Time will come we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. I'll talk to you later. Yeah, what was that? There was something... something green... Oh, it's that there. Okay, let's go to that. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, friggin' runny nose. I apologise. Let's go talk to my bitch. Talk to Lily yet? Yeah. She thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment, too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Told you. What a guess. I think about you, too. Our group is small. You're small. You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Uh, you're probably right. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? <sighs> I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. If I can bet be right, if I fall out of anyone now, I'm gonna come shoot you in the face, bitch. Ooh. Don't call me small. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you have any uh, chalk I can borrow? What, Clementine holding out on you? So you don't have any? No, why would I? You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her, that's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's <laughs> never <laughs> going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now it doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's oh, really? different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know. This place is fine, but... We all know that that could change at any second. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Good idea. Oh my god, yeah. I wonder what those bullet holes have... No, what are you doing? I didn't... I didn't tell you to do that. I didn't put... I actually didn't push anything there. That's gay. Hey, car. Uh... Awkward. Right, so... Go talk to Lily and tell her what I found. Hey. Find anything? Uh. I need to tell you something. Sure, go ahead. But if it's bad news, maybe save it. Uh. I killed someone before all of this. Shit. What? Dad said there was something about you. So you know. I didn't know what to know. Well, it's true, and I'm sorry. He treated you like shit, knew who you were, and you tried to save his life. The last thing you need to do is apologize. 
Thank you. You killed a guy. So what? I bet he was a dick. Well, it, it ruined my life. Good thing everyone else has got destroyed shortly thereafter, huh? Misery loves company. <laughs> I had a boss. <laughs> so I couldn't tell her about what... Um... Okay, so... Where can I go? Where can I go? Where can I... What's that? Oh, it's just some shit on the floor. Hey, Ben, I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my... Well, my thoughts. And I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to tell him. Um, so I can't go that way. Let's see if I can go around the, the RV. Can I not go further around? Right. Okay. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Uh, Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car, and I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. <sighs> so these two. Hi, guys. Can I talk to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? Uh... I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. You've always looked at me with kind eyes. I wonder if you could still do that if you, uh, knew I was a convicted felon. My goodness, for what? How much trouble can a teacher get into? Well, plenty. But it had nothing to do with that. It was for murder. Why? He and my wife, uh... That's were... enough. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. I was given Larry CPR with Lily. Kenny came in from out of nowhere and put a stop to it. What did he do? He smashed his head in. <gasps> uh, might have just upset their relationship gotcha. a little. Everything keeps changing. She... Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Yeah? What do you got? It's serious. Okay, should I sit down? Come on. <laughs> I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. Wasn't for touching kids, was it? No, it wasn't. Because we got two here. I killed a guy in a fight. Should I be worried there's anything else in your past that's gonna come out? No. Good. But you should know, if we gotta make numbers when it comes to a boat, this is gonna matter. Ouch. Right, okay, so that's done. 
Right, so what do I do? Is that a hot scotch? Oh, I don't know because I can't see it now. I don't know where to go, or look, or do, or what. Um. Um. Go talk to Carly. See if that makes any difference now that I've told people. I, uh, talked to Kenny about who I am. And? I don't know. Feels like I just gave him ammo, if we ever have to make any tough decisions when it comes to a headcount. Ah. Uh, well, don't worry. I talked to Katja. How'd she take it? She was fine, I guess. I think she's more upset about Kenny. Because of the St. John's? What exactly did he do back there? Oh, don't you start now. I talked to Clementine about things. How'd she handle it? I don't know. She's tough to read. She adores you. Don't worry. I told Lily. You were right. She and Larry spoke, obviously. She was all right, though. Well, you're about all she's got left. I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you later. Oof. They're gonna end up getting it all at one point. Alright, so I've talked to Clementine. Possibly. I found a torch. Uh, oh, did I talk to him about the torch? Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Taste that there. What do you think about? What do you think about Lily? What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's <laughs> a reasonable thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. Uh. Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Macon. Oh, I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. It's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is... <laughs> Dickhead. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. Right. Uh, see if Doug's. Where's, where's Duck? Got a, got a, got a duck. <sighs> Have you found anything else? Just the chalk. I also found some bugs underneath the stairs. Don't tell Clementine. <laughs> okay, I won't. <laughs> uh. You seem to know a bit about all of this. The chalk? You found the scuff here? This is gonna sound crazy, but you're not involved, are you? No, I'm a good guy. Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. I don't get it. What am I supposed to do? Hi, Lee. Well, that's it. That's all I get. All right, let's see if I can go talk to Lily. Hey. Find anything? Are you worried about morale at all? The darker things get, the more we have to worry about people giving up. Tell me about it. I know you won't. I'm worried, but what can we do? I don't know. Do you ever want to leave here? I want to leave here when we have to, not because of some fantasy of somewhere better. So, you think the coast is a pipe dream? Don't you? We're going to live on the water because we assume they can't swim? We're alive because we've stayed here. That's as far as the discussion needs to go. 
I'll be back. Oh. I can't go that way. I don't get it. Oh dear. No, really don't get it. Well, that's another 20 minutes. <laughs> Made some progress, I guess, a little bit, but uh, yeah. We'll be back in a mojo. I'm Grim's Creed. I'm out.